New tonight, a challenge to Tennessee Governor Bill Lee from native Memphian and current city councilman J.B. Smiley Jr. He announced today that he is a candidate for governor. You know, jumping from a first term councilman to the governor's office, especially the governor's chair of the 17th largest state in the country is going to be quite a challenge. Fox 13's Greg Coy is live in Whitehaven. That's part of Smiley's district. And Greg, to beat an incumbent governor, first of all, you need money and you really need name recognition. Well, I can tell you that Councilman Smiley Jr. does have a fundraising operation that's already on the ground. But as for name recognition, well, we came here to the Piccadilly because Merle and Dow, you know, this place is known for its comfort food, but also because this is where the politicians and the civic leaders like to meet and discuss issues around the table. So we talked to a lot of constituents leaving the restaurant. Some knew the councilman, knew his name. Some were unfamiliar, some didn't know him at all. Now that name recognition could cause a problem down the road for a politician from West Tennessee that's trying to win statewide. I mean, go with me to a better Tennessee. Freshman Memphis City Councilman J.B. Smiley Jr. wants to be Tennessee's next governor, announcing his intention and campaign today with a video and strong criticism for the incumbent Republican governor, Bill Lee. As the governor, you have to come out strong. Leadership is difficult. If you're not willing to make the leadership, the strong leadership decisions, get out the way. Smiley represents parts of Super District 8, which includes sections of the middle class neighborhood of Whitehaven. We talked to his constituents outside the popular Piccadilly restaurant. I'd ask him what he's done as a councilman for the Whitehaven. Before you decide whether or not you're going to support him for government. Right. I really don't know who he is. Other constituents told me the councilman and Memphis native has their support. He's been doing good for the for the area, so I mean he can do much more if he was governor. Yeah, if he's the governor. This woman wondered if Smiley's higher political aspirations should wait since he was just elected to the council. That's his option if that's what he wanna do. But I'd rather for him to be here and see what he can do for Whitehaven and other places around the city. Now that he's a candidate for Governor J.B. Smiley Jr., certainly he's going to have to raise his name recognition. Also, he's going to have to raise a lot of money. When we checked the state's election website, Governor Bill Lee, the incumbent, has more than $2 million in the bank getting ready for his reelection fight. Live in Whitehaven, I'm Greg Coy, Fox 13 News.